Hey guys, it's Bright and welcome back to my channel. Today we are here on the Fallen SMP server for episode number one, so let's get started. All right, wasn't that just a fantastic intro? Thank you, Bright. Um, so now this is building Bright that we get to see. She is building, I think, in this episode. It's our starter home, our Fletcher house that is where our Fletcher villagers are, and then I think we get to see the enchantment tower. So we get to see three amazing builds. The starter house, I wanted to still do the medieval style wood and um, deep slate house that we were going with from last season. So for 18.5, or season 18 and a half, um, we're going with the same style. So we're using dark oak, we're using spruce, we're using birch, which is something that I never use, but with these block, with the block palette that we're using, it looks really nice, surprisingly. And I'm quite surprised with how the buildings look with it. Um, shocking, I know, because birch isn't something that people use to build with. Like, it's kind of one of those woods that just sits there, like acacia, so yeah, we're using it. Acacia and jungle. No one really builds with those ones. And birch, but um, this one we are. Um, this house is a more of the medieval style than it appears to be. We use a lot of trap doors and the spruce on the roofs because the um, trap doors look really nice. I love these trap doors along with dark oak. We're learning different styles. We're going out of our comfort zone just a little bit. Um, by that I mean we're stepping out of our comfort zone with building much bigger builds. Something that I don't really do. Normally I do small builds. Like this is a small build but it's very very detailed. Um, you can tell that by the end and with the starter frame that we have going on now that um, it's very detailed and I loved the flowers and I decided to use these big trees that we have. It's just so beautiful and I can't wait to see what the rest has to bring. I'm also liking this style of video so let me know how you guys like this um, style video because I'm liking it so far. Uh, I just don't know if you guys are so just let me know. The voiceover build style videos. I'm a builder, so I'd much rather do building videos rather than gameplay. However, the gameplay is coming. I promise I will show you some gameplay. Um, currently, as of now, today, uh, April 26th, this video was being filmed uh, April 9th or the 10th. Yeah. So it's been a few, few weeks since it opened, but... Um, Currently, I just got all netherite armor, so I'm quite proud of that myself. I've never done that before in Minecraft, and I did it myself in survival, so quite proud of that myself, but yeah, we're just, we're watching the starter house be built. That roof, I love that roof because there's so much detail in it with the deep slate. I used the three different kind of deep slate blocks that we got, and it looks so nice. Here you can see me doing the walls the birch walls. Um, <clears throat> this one I just used straight stripped birch but in the next house you can see that I kind of went a little bit out of my style with the way that I did the walls and you'll see that in just a little bit. Um, yeah. Are, are we going to go to the front? Yeah we're going to go to the front here soon. I have this nice little um, deck, porch, front, yard, hanging, strip, roof thing with the campfires. And I think it looked beautiful at the end. Um, here you can see me doing that. What would you call this? Like, what would you call the way that, like, what is this? Like a porch? Like an on floor porch, yard area thing? What would you call that? I don't know what to call it. Um, all I know is that I loved the way that it turned out and it looks super nice, but this is the first little bit of the starter house. 
Now we're moving on to the Fletcher house, and this is where our Fletcher villagers are. I didn't know, at the time of me building this, I didn't know what the house was gonna be. I just liked the way that it looked. This one, um, I found on Google. I don't know who built it, but thank you to whoever did, because the front of the house is what made me wanted to build it. So this isn't coming from my brain, but you know, it still took a little bit of work because I just had the front portion of the house. I had to figure out the back and the sides of my house, this myself. But then that's the way that the walls were is what made me want to start building with that style. How you use the stripped logs, but also use the planks. So that's why I wanted to try this build and see if it would work with the block pile that I was using. Which is what really caught my eye. So that's, that's what made me want to build this. Um, the front, oh my gosh, this front bit that you'll be able to see at the end is so beautiful, the way that the, and I continued the roof, I continued the block palette for the roof because it looks super nice and I think with all of the builds around it, it's gonna look so good. Um, <clears throat> you can tell that I only had the front bit of the picture to go off of, so now I was like, I'm going to build the roof, and then uh, we could build the sides, and then we could build back, because I had no idea what that looked like, because the picture only came with the front of the of the house, so I had to figure it out myself. So here you can see me doing the roof with what was in the picture, and then the rest is me just kind of guessing what it would be. I also think that there should be an attic, but because my villagers live there, um, I just didn't want to do that because then I have to put um, villagers up there and then I will have to deal with iron golems and stuff like that so I just didn't do that I just didn't do it so yeah but you can see me trying to figure out how to do the siding and how to do the back of the house I was like freaked out because I was like oh that doesn't line up now I gotta figure it out so you can see me trying to do that but I continued the walls coming down off the corners of the house, those hold the lanterns. And see, I was doing the birch, I was getting the birch walls in. And then I was like, oh, well, let's do the roof because this part's gonna be the hardest part. So we'll continue with the roof. And then I was like, oh, well, this isn't lining up the way that I want it to. So now I have to like figure it out. Like, I was like, what the hell? What the heck? But there I am doing it. Um, with my one single chess piece because I kept dying because I refused to um, mine without having at least a few buildings up because there are some amazing builders on this server and I was like I'm gonna be an amazing builder too which n not to, to my own horn but I do think I am one of the better builders of small youtubers but that's a full, like a, a big statement to say, so I'm just gonna say that. Cancel me, it's okay. Um, and then here's this big tower. Now this big tower took me a total of, I think it was two hours after recording it, but I continued to work on it for another hour. So it was about three hours worth of building this oh my god this wanted to i wanted to die while i was building this but it looks so good this is where my enchanting table is um you can see the mistakes that i did within the uh tower but i fixed it don't worry however there's one that i'm not fixing until someone tells me to on the server because it's just too high up and i just i can't be bothered with it but it has my enchant table in it, um, just on the ground level. The rest of the levels are uh, just free open space with torches. I didn't know what to put in there. I uh, still don't know what to put in there, so let me know what you want to see in there, if, if you want to at all. Uh, don't know where the ladders would go to go up or stairs, but... We can figure that out, just mi uh, minimal things. Um, there's no lighters yet, we have yet to do the end dragon, but I have a feeling that that is coming soon. You can see how much detail already is going into the tower, and this is only the, f the second level. There's four levels of this tower and a roof, so 
you can see that it's taking a lot out of me already and I've just started it. I'm like, oh lord. And then I kept messing up while I was doing this and I was in my head when I was building this and out loud. I was like, man, this would take less time if I just stopped messing up. But that's okay. You know, things happen. But you can see me doing the first bit of roof. There is a second roof. Um, this is how it just gets turned into a smaller little tower. Yeah, and here we are building the third level now. Um, it took so many Minecraft days, guys. It took way too many Minecraft days. I also kept dying, so that's why the water bucket's there. <laughs> yeah, see, here's a couple of the mistakes because I forgot to strip some of the, some of the wood, but it is now stripped. Don't worry about it. I, I got it and I fixed it because I saw the video when I rendered it out and I was like, I, I need to fix that. <laughs> so it's fixed. Flowers aren't put in the flower pots yet, but I'm not too worried about that because that area of the place clearly is not done yet. So once we move the path and trees over that way, um, we'll get it done. But we're focusing on the main area so far, which is, um, all of our villagers. I would like to get all of the villagers done and ready to go. Um, my shop this season, uh, last season I didn't get to build a shop because the shopping district was way too far from my house. But now I have my nether portal and it's easier to get to spawn. So now we get to build a shop. My shop is going to be what um, some of the people did in X Life. So my shop is going to be you pay diamonds and I get to build for you. So you get to pick a build style you get to pick how big you want the build to be obviously um, whatever style and how long it takes will be the price but I'm excited because I get to build and that's what I love to do you can see this roof is very intricate design with the, with the stairs as well so that's my shop for this season I'm quite excited about it it's I think the minimal price will be 10 diamonds and it'll be like for a small house what you can see down there and then a tower like this would probably be like 15 to 20 diamonds I don't want it to be too expensive because I do want people to you know use the shop and like um, want to have a build done by me so, excuse me, so I think we're going to make it um, a little bit cheaper, but you know, it's a game, it's to have fun, so yeah, now we're just finishing up the roof, and then I think the build will be done. There we go, boop, 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 boop. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I hope you guys enjoyed that little time sequence that we did. The bland is coming together so beautifully. I have more videos coming of the builds that I've done, so keep your eyes out for that. Subscribe if you want to, like the video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys!